Would you rather pay $650 or $66 for a smartphone? Simple. With the Appalachian Advantage plan, pay less up front and then just a few dollars more every month. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. For the Kentucky Blood Center, 9-11 is a time to remember and commemorate a long-standing tradition between donors and the need to save lives. Thursday, we spoke with Vice President External Relations, Mandy Braja, about their blood drive this weekend. Yeah, so everyone is likely aware that um, Saturday is the 20th anniversary of the attacks on America on September 11th. And um, since that time, we have been annually honoring people who came out and gave blood uh, in you know, in hopes after immediately after the attacks of helping uh, survivors that may need blood products, of course, we realized very soon that wasn't going to be the case. Um, but the spirit of with which people came out, you know, rolled up their sleeves, we've honored every year on this date. And because this is a, a monumental anniversary, we wanted to kind of make a big deal, um, applaud those people who've been coming out throughout the years, and then hopefully invite someone to become a blood donor for the first time. Uh, it doesn't take a tragedy um, to, you know, encourage folks to roll up their sleeves, but it, it's sort of that spirit of remembrance that hopefully will allow people to come out and become blood donors. To become a donor, you can visit the Kentucky Blood Center at 472 South Mayo Trail, Pikeville, Kentucky, from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. Friday and 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. Saturday. Donors must be 16 years or older with the parents' permission. For Mountaintop News, I'm Joel Cordial.